Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a tutorial on how I style my hair. This is like my everyday kind of textured, messy hair, and it also has volume at the roots. I've gotten a lot of questions on how I style my hair on Instagram, so I thought I'd sit down and show you guys today because it's super simple. I do one thing that kind of makes me look like a hot mess for a minute, but you'll see why whenever we get into the tutorial part. But today I'm using the 3-in-1 one from Numi. This is the 25 millimeter barrel. I go between using this one and the 32. The 32 is just going to be a little bit of a softer look but I wanted to show you guys how you could get a lot of texture so that's the one that I'm using today. That wand is also part of a set. This is a curl jam set and I wanted to talk to you guys about it really quickly because if you're anything like me you would love this set. I got on their site and of course they have wands that have like a million attachments with it and I thought about getting one of those but then I realized I only use like the 25 and the 32. I don't ever use like the pearl or the tapered and this is perfect. It has everything in here that I would ever need to style my hair. It has the 25 the 32 and then I think this one's a 16 it's a smaller one and then it has a straightener in here and I love this straightener of course you can wear your hair straight but the thing I love about it is that it has like the rounded edge so I love curling my hair with my straightener so I have a straightener and then all the size barrels that I would need to style my hair in one place it also comes with the glove of course and everything just rolls up really nicely and it has like these little button enclosures that go all the way up for when you travel like you have essentially like four styling options in this little case and then also when you open it up it has like a little hanging thing right here so I just think this is perfect especially for someone that travels a lot but just for anyone that loves to style their hair so I will have this linked in the description box below and I will also have coupon codes because Numi always has really awesome coupon codes and I want to share those with you guys so if you'd like to see those check the description box below and if you'd like to see how I style my hair then just keep watching I always like to start off by sectioning my hair in half and the other side that I'm not using right now, I'm just gonna tie it up with a little tie and then I'm going to go in with my 25 millimeter wand. And this is the part that I told you guys makes you look a little crazy, but this gives the same effect as like pinning up your curls because your curl is still hot right here and then I'm just gonna let it cool on the opposite side. So I just toss the curl all the way over to that other side and it's gonna cool that way and doing that is gonna help give a lot of volume. So the way I'm curling my hair is actually super simple. I'm just curling everything away from my face and leaving about an inch out at the bottom for the top two sections and always throwing it over to that other side to cool. But when I get to like my bang area, I like to take it down a little bit further on my hair because I don't wanna have like a super tight curl and I always just leave those down. I don't toss them to the other side. And like I said, just curl those top two sections all away from your face. So now that I'm done with the top two sections of my hair all the way from my face, I'm going to just pin those up so that they can cool. And the bottom section of my hair, I'm just going to alternate the curls. So I go towards my face and away from my face. And I don't really have a system. I just kind of pick pieces and do them whichever way I want to. But alternating these is going to help give a lot more volume and body to the hair. Even on these bottom sections, I do like to make sure that the pieces that are closest to my face are always curled away. It just makes my face look slimmer and it's just more flattering on me, so that's what I do. And there is the curled hair on one side and straight on the other. So we're gonna leave that side alone and get to curling on the other side. I'm doing it exactly the same. I'm doing all curls away from my face for the top two sections, and then I'll pin that up out of the way, toss it to the other side, and then we'll do the bottom section. One thing I do when I'm styling my hair like this besides dancing is to make sure that that hair is flat on the iron. And then if I get any pieces that are too curly for me like that front piece, I just kind of pull on them and straighten them out a little bit while they're still hot. I love this hairstyle, but I especially love doing it with a wand because these curls will last in my hair forever. I can literally do this hairstyle and then my hair will look like this and look even a little bit better and more tousled. And I can wear this hairstyle for like three days with a little dry shampoo and I am good to go. 
Now I'm just pinning up those top two sections that we curled all away from our face and finishing up the curls by doing those bottom sections towards my face and away from my face. And if you guys were wondering in like real time, this takes me probably about 10 minutes to curl all of my hair. It is so quick that barrel gets super, super hot. And the last curl is done, so let's take that clip out and you can see the volume and texture that my hair has now. So I'm just taking my fingers and running it through and breaking up those curls. And what I like to do is break them up so it doesn't look like one big curl and it just makes my hair even more voluminous. But I do have lots of flyaways and baby hairs, especially like after having my babies, my hair grows back. And I have these tiny little hairs and frizzy spots because my hair is naturally curly. So I'm going in with the Numi Argan Oil. I love this stuff. I'm literally drenching my hair in this. I just rub it between my hands and warm it up and then I'm going through especially my ends and then those front pieces where I have a lot of those baby hairs and this just makes my hair look so shiny and makes it so soft and just makes my hair look super polished. Now I'm just taking a little bit of the Texture Tease from Garnier. This is a really great drugstore texturizing spray. And I'm just picking up sections and spraying underneath where I want to have more texture and body. And this just helps to give you a nice little bit of hold without being like super crunchy on your hair. This last step is totally optional. It's just something that I like to do. And I like to take the sections that are framing my face and do a little bit of teasing there. And then I also do just a tiny bit. I like the top of my crown. And I just like the little bit of volume that it gives me. So like I said, it's totally optional, but this is what I do. So once you get done with this teasing, you just kind of want to mess with it and get it the way you want it to look. And you could definitely finish up with some hairspray as well. But this is what it looks like whenever I'm done. I hope you guys enjoyed this and found it helpful. Don't forget to look in the description box for the coupon codes from Numi. And I will see you guys in my next tutorial very soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.